P.S.Y. Oopsie daisy, I've forgotten the voice. Syndicate! Welcome to the Pirates! So yo-ho! <laughs> Yo, what's up, boys? And if you've ever wondered what you get for $5 on Twitch these days, it's apparently a very badly pronounced version of your name. I don't know how you can subscribe to someone and then they mispronounce your name, but I thought I'd include that, because holy shit, that's impressive, mispronouncing my name that badly. It's probably ten times worse than calling me PSI. In fact, it's just PSY. I mean, there's an I there. There's, it doesn't look like a Y. But either way, don't tell that guy I included that in my intro, because I didn't ask him for permission. Um, what I'm going to be showing you guys today is a Exile mod, which claims to be a Daisy mod recreation. I've actually found a bike already, which is good. We just used to Electra right now, and Exile something which I've wanted to obviously bring back to my channel, as is a million and one different things. But basically, what does this have? Well, it's Exile Shinaris Winter, which is fucking awesome. I do love me some, some good old... Um, Shinaris, and it is Winter, which I've never actually played before, which is pretty cool. And on top of that, also uses a mod you guys would have seen recently, um, maybe, which is, I think it's called the Shinaris Expanded mod or something. It makes it so pretty much every single house is enterable. A lot of them are actually really cool as well. So we've got like, is that a backpack actually? I don't actually know. Let's see, I think it is. Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, some of them have got upstairs and downstairs and shit. They're actually pretty fucking cool. Obviously, loot spawns inside them. And um, there's a few things on this map of interest. Like, there's a college apparently over there. You can see a bridge over to Skaliski. There's an apartment complex, which have got these really cool, complicated uh, apartments. I'm not going to be, sure be able to show you guys all of the cool stuff today, since, of course, we do have limited time. Um, but basically, it's a Shinaris, which is wintry, which is great, because everyone loves winter. And um, it's got more buildings to go in, so pretty fucking cool shit. As for always, if you guys would like to see some more of this kind of shit, aka Exile, Shinaris Winter, then um, just just drop the like and the comment and, and the unsubscribe and I'll make sure to see what I can do. But anyway, we're going to get on the bike, probably head over to Electro and then um, shoot some people, maybe. I don't know. You get the idea. It, it's pretty cool. There's also a lot of custom weapons, but we'll see those in just a second. So much cool shit in it, though. I mean, it's got an MP5. I've seen, like, a sniper of a scope before. In fact, I'll edit in when I killed some dude with it. That was pretty fucking cool. <laughs> Um, got some pawn over here as well, and it also uses actually the parkour mod, the um, armor advanced movement thing, whatever the fuck it's called, so you can jump on top of roofs. I'm assuming there's a collision on it. It does, so you can jump on top of roofs, snipe people from them and shit. It's really fucking fun. Really fun. There's unfortunately only 50 people per server for those zombies. Um, oh shit, I've seen a lightning strike. That was cool. So that's probably the downfall, really. I just wish I was able to get more people on it, but I can say without a doubt, there's gonna be people in Electro, so does it really fucking matter? In fact, there's a dude on the road right there. I was thinking it's a fresh one, we'll go talk to him. But he's trying to offer the genuine armor experience. He's probably, you probably steal my bike. Yo, oh, what's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? On the ground, buddy! Hello? on the ground. Cold. It'll be warmer on the ground, dude. We can hug. Let's cu let's hug each other. Come hug. Come hug. Come hug. What we do? Don't try to steal my bike, you little dick. <laughs> Fucking stinky man. <laughs> Genuine armor experience. Killing fresh spawns. Oh, fuck's sake, man. And fucking broken bikes. There we go. Fixed it. I don't know, Electro's looking a bit empty right now. TBH. It is kind of, uh, it's like therapeutic and like kind of fun to just do nothing in this one. Just because it's snowy and shit and it's like, woo! Can actually park on top of this roof as well, so I'm going to go and do that. You know, we can scout out Electro that way. And this place does have collision, I checked it out before. But yeah, the dude that killed was up on that hill over somewhere over there. And it was a bit dark then, but that dude had some pretty good shit. But I got killed. Oh, dude in the tower. I killed like a second layer. Alright, we need to go and drop down over here. And then we're going to go ahead and try to slay this dude over here. Should be still looting the fire station under much of the time I get there. But there's just so many enterable builds and so many lootables. It's pretty fucking cool, to be honest. Hopefully line of sight here. Head to the left. You can see there's a hotel over there as well for fucking plane stuck in it. You also spawn with a flashlight, as you can see right there. In case you do end up in night time. But yeah, the, the, the palms are so fucking cool. I wish I could show you guys what's better. I just can't. Because I don't have a map. Oh! I! I'm triggered. <laughs> you know, it's kind of why Exile's like, you know, kill someone, die. Except I killed a fresh spawn, so that's pretty impressive. Maybe we'll have a chance to show you guys the apartments in. That was a disappointment. <laughs> just got one tapped. 
But you know, I'm not here to show you guys amazing gameplay. Like, if any day I'm an aggressive ass fucking player, and that's my downfall in Exile. That's why I don't really like playing Exile because it upsets me when I play because I just die. I don't have any friends. But like, with these little uh, eye kind of things, it's pretty cool. Um, I am just east of Electro again, so. Could we just run back there? <laughs> I don't know, that dude even headshot me or had like a pretty high ca I mean, it was clearly a rifle, it was a bull action rifle, but fuck me, dude, that was... If he just missed, you know, he'd be dead, but he didn't. Well played, maybe it was two of them there, maybe it was two of them there, I don't know. I don't believe that dude, like, unless it was no loot in the tower, I guess it was just no loot in the tower, so he just fucking zoomed back down. I should have played a bit more slowly. Oh, look how cute that is, you can even go inside a little basement in this house. I mean, it's kind of fucked, but like, it's so cool, like... What's the point of Daisy Stanley when you've got this, right, guys? Ooh, hello. That's a little Enfield. Oh, no, it's not. It's, for, it's actually the sniper which I used before. So, let's see if we can actually slay someone today. That'd be that'd be pretty decent. You know, someone who's in the fucking fresh spawn. Uh, I did just get slayed a second ago. Zip tie there to tie someone up, which... There is zip ties and loads of, like, food and shit inside this. But I'm near below right now, so my plan is to... Try to get around that. To, um... Go over to below and then maybe go to the below... -er. Um, apartments, which I haven't shown you guys yet. I don't know. I don't know why people really play it. But seriously, if you are going to play this, play it with someone. It makes it so much easier. They can just secure your loot. They can get a vehicle and pick you up. Like, friends are good. Friends are good. I have no friends. Probably just going to miss a shot of this bully, to be honest. Oh. On. Stay still. This is a robbery. Oh, what the fuck? I got him, I got him, I got him. Yo, dude, stay still, stay still, this is a robbery. Stay still, dude, I wanna oh, tie, no I wanna way. tie you up. No way. Let no me tie way. you up. What's wrong? No way. What's wrong? No Shut up. Top keck, Lamau, dude, smelly face. Yo, dude, this, this dude's got nice shit. Sorry, I just like shooting people, you know, feels good, man. Let's go and take this dude's shit. So this dude's got range finders. An AK. That was some pretty shoddy shooting from my guy, to be honest. I mean, I'm pretty bad too, but you know, I was... <laughs> What's that? Is that him? I guess it might be global chat or some shit. Yeah, I mean, look at this thing. This is the thing I was sniping. Look at the animations and shit in a man. It's pretty fucking sick. We've got some snowy clothes in case you're wondering. Um, actually, I don't know where that is, but you can... You can see in the bottom right the... Oh, I guess we've actually removed the normal UI, but the bottom right shows you your food and your... Um, your... Uh, uh, temperature, that's the one. Temperature, shit like that. So, that is something you are going to have to look out for since it is a wintry Shinaris. But this is pretty fucking sick clothes, let's be honest. You can't put this in your backpack, which is kind of annoying. But, do I really need it? Not really. I'm just going to drop it. As much as I do like it, I would like to put it in a backpack, but it just doesn't fit in here. Like, watch. And oh, no, it does, okay. I guess my backpack I had before is really small. We don't need to say it, yeah? We can take this and go ahead and reload it. And there we go. I don't know how to zip tie that dude up. He was just upset me because he's been a big fan gay, to be honest. But, I'm sorry for killing you, dude. It's just, you know, it's probably killed death ratio, man. This is Call of Duty at the end of the day, isn't it? Oh, it's just so cool, all these NO builds and shit. Like, we can park on top of any of these buildings and use them to our advantage. Oh, except this one. You just jump through the window of this one. No, you can't jump on top of it. I promise you guys. Yeah, so you can. Maybe there's a little... Oh, no, I just jumped through it. Oh, whatever, dude. You, you can totally get on top of it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I just really, like I said, wish... Was more than 50 players? Maybe you could have more than 50 players. Like, winter Shinara servers are just popping up right now because, you know, it's winter and shit. Oh, it's not winter. Is it winter? When does winter even start? I'm retarded. I don't know. Um, but, a uh, server like this with more people on it would be pretty fucking cool. Definitely. Anyway, Blota is right there. I don't have a map. In fact, I do just seen a second ago. I might have had a map. But, the uh, Blota apartments are just uh, northeast of Blota, so... If I survive my trip to Blur, which I may do, I may not, since it is a popular military hotspot, there's actually two ATCs in it, um, then I'll head over to the apartments. I would say the mod definitely doesn't feel quite like the old Daisy mod. You know, if you want to play a real Daisy mod, Desolation, in fact, a new mod, which I think some people asked me to play, or some people did, only a few, Armor Free e e something? Armor Free. It's not Epoch, or not Exile. I mean, it's not even an E. Well, there's the apartments right there we can see, because it's actually not cloudy now, and also it's raining. Um, but yeah, that's a desolation server of TFR and stuff, 50 slots as well in, um, you know, normal Shinaris. Like, that's, that's, desolation's a better DC mod experience, but I still have met, I think, two or three people who haven't shot me when I have been unarmed. Obviously, I've shot two unarmed people because I'm a piece of shit, uh, but yeah, I don't know. People do seem actually reasonably nice here. 
But yeah, you'll see Vishnara's apartments. Those are very rep reminiscent of the Daisy ones. There's a heli on top of one of them. You can see right there. That's the one I went up before. And you can go access every single building. Or every single floor. Yeah, there's like stairs up every single floor. There's ladders. I, I've never been in there daytime. So I do really want to check it out. But it's a really, really cool building. And you can actually have PvP from uh, one apartment to another. So, I doubt I'm going to find anyone up there, and I don't think it's really too good loot, but there is a lot of flaws with a lot of loot. Whether it's good or bad, it's still, you know, food and water to keep you surviving, because that's what this is all about. It's all about surviving, guys. It's always great about the Daisy mod, even though he didn't kill people in the early days, it felt good to just exist. I wouldn't really say it does anymore. You know, now with all these fucking pumped up PvP M240 420 smoke weed every day servers, it doesn't really fucking matter anymore, but... Um, it was definitely a unique experience for the longest time. If we, what have we got in here? We've got ourselves an AK. Oh, that's not an AK, that's a fucking SIG and also a flashlight, which is a bit worrying. Map? Yep, map. Okay, good. So I'll show sure you guys a map now. So, uh, you'll see the university or college over there. Apartments, Pavlovo military base. You can see it's very, very reminiscent of the, uh, Daisy Standalone game. Um, of course it is Exile as well, so you can do base building. There is, of course, a zone to go ahead and trade with people. If you guys haven't seen Exile already, it's a great mod. It's got this beautiful PDA thing going on. You can add people to groups. Oh, kill death ratio, I told you. Wait, I guess when on people don't count towards your kills. Okay, whatever, fuck you. Um, but yeah. What was one that can actually park on top of you? I can't, okay, oh, oh shit. Oh. Okay, I could try to park or down, but I'd rather not die today. So let's just go to the apartments. Your friendly body. Your friendly body. Take that as a no body. So an axe, which of course is the way to do base building. If you really should loot people after you kill them, but you know, I'm stupid, so this goes in the middle slot. Let's go ahead and take that, swap out. Assuming this is the same kind of AK. Uh, this dude does have a, is this a vest? No, it's not a vest. I don't know what the fuck that even is. Bandelier is a vest. Well, he's got a very nice fucking backpack, actually. Alright, boys. We in the green. It does seem like pretty much every single weapon you're going to find are going to be reminiscent of Armor 2 weapons. I haven't seen any classic Armor 3 weapons yet. Um, Lee Enfield's that bullet action I've seen before, the MP5, um, I mean a lot of these aren't actually in Armor 2 or a lot of ones you'll find in this, but even with a new, you won't find like classic Armor 3 weapons, or at least, like I said, not in my experiences so far, which is pretty cool. The plan is either way, we're going to go check out the below apartments, give you guys a massive boner because of how cool they are. Doubt I'm going to find anyone here, but who knows, it is daytime now, like last time I said, I was here, I was camping in one of these windows with a G36K, uh, which is one of the toggle side, um, and I just waiting for someone to come up, and no one ever came up this hill, so... I mean, it could be someone in here. I mean, look at how big these fucking apartments are. The FPS isn't the best, though, because it is... I don't know, it's got a lot of interiors and shit, but it works. But either way, they spilled right here. You wouldn't have seen it before. It's actually got uh, the normal apartment thing, which you'll see. Is that a gunshot? Maybe no gunshot in uh, below. Uh, but yeah, it's got the normal apartment things, as you'll see. But then it's also actually got this part over here, which has got a bunch of rooms. And... Um, and obviously you can shoot out of these windows if you want, rest your weapon on the edge, whatever you want. And then you've also got this little shaft over here, which is used for going up and down. So it's an elevator shaft. So yeah, you can go up and down every single one of these floors. Every single one of the floors have got loot. It's pretty fucking insane. I'm going to go on the roof quickly and just have a look over. And then we're going to go head down to Chernogorsk and see what kind of trouble we can get into over there. But yeah, these stairs will bring you all the way to the top. I always had a massive bono of idea of running at someone in the DC standalone apartment systems. As you guys will know, they're very similar to these ones. I don't know, just be like, I'll, I'll show you guys when I'm near the top, but no, yeah, we're at the top right now. So you can go up some ladders right now. I couldn't see too well be before because of uh, how dark it was, but I think ladders are like here or some shit. Let's see. Ladder down, can we go up these? No, we can't. I don't know how to get up these ladders then, because I don't know how I even got up before, to be honest. It was so fucking dark. Um, but yeah, I also had a, a, a bone over the idea of like looking here and then like, seeing someone over there, for example. You know, you could see someone like loot that building or like see someone over there, like just fucking smoking some weed. Obviously, oh, and also you've got these little closet spaces. Obviously, I know it ended up happening, but, you know, it's a cool idea. Let's see if we can actually park it out. Apparently not. Epic. 
See, I could like parkour and like try to like parkour over to one of these. I don't think this thing's actually got collision, but I could like maybe try to jump it up roof this way. It's a bit risky though. I don't really like the idea of losing all my shit, so if we can't get on the roof, so be it. But there is definitely a way to get on top of the roof. I don't think I can fall down here, can I? Nah, okay. Go up. I'm not at that. Maybe this will be like up now. Nope, still down. Fuck you. Alright, we're not going up today, boys. Could do parkour. Not really interested. We're going to go to Cherno and get killed in Cherno instead to wrap this one up. But either way, if I do end up playing this again, I mentioned a few days ago on one of my other videos, but uh, Rush is alive and he plays video games on, on, the, on the reg now, so I could go play with Rush. I'll bring up some really, some really good old vibes. Some cement right here, I think, as well, for uh, base building. No, sand. Whatever, you can totally mix cement out of sand. I think. I wish I had the fucking scope version of this thing, because I just had some gunshots from over in Baloa. Like, as you would have seen in that video earlier, the scope on it's really fucking decent. But yeah, I don't know, I'm going to have to leave those guys be. Probably somewhere around the, uh, hangers, but Shannon will be okay. Shannon will be okay. But I'm guessing you can take pretty much anything you can find in the game, bring it over to the trader, as you would normally sell it in Exile, so... That's how you get vehicles and shit, and I'm guessing probably start with some- No, we don't start with any pop tabs, okay. <laughs> oh, there's even like a little fucking military compound thing over there, or a little parking place, that's cool. Gunshots. Behind. Wow, boys, it's exile, who would have fucking guessed? So why don't I actually do that? I'm, I'm don't plan on ever making a base, like, if I end up doing more than one part, like I said, if you guys like, then... I don't know, I'm, I'm not fucking, I'm not spending time, like, building a base. Like, that's one of the reasons why I don't play base and Rust, I guess, just because, like, one of the, the biggest big way to be the biggest big on the server is to kind of, like, spend that time and get a base, and I'm just too lazy, you know? I don't mind, like, riding off the back of someone and <laughs> living in an air base, but I play a lot of different video games here at South Syndicate Enterprises. I don't have the time to fucking build a base. I mean, I do, but I just don't, you know? I just don't. It would have seen pretty much no zombies the entire time, by the way. Eh, I am not surprised, but that's that's just how it is, to be honest. That is just how it is. There isn't going to be that many zombies, because FPS is shit enough as it is. I'm at 24 FPS right now. And my CPU costs more than your house, mate. 1590-60X. It's a bit outdated now, but you know. It's still more expensive than your house. So. It's not my PC, okay? I literally bought the CPU, because everyone was like, Buy a better CPU, Lewis. You've got the money for it. And I did it. Didn't make a fucking bit of difference. I mean, it made rendering a bit easier, but, you know. Oh, my stubborn's like, shit. I think maybe I've just got, like, used to it being winner, but it doesn't really seem that much of a big deal anymore, but it's still pretty cool, you know? I'd reckon playing on it at least once in your life. You guys will recognize where we are right now if you've played Shinaris before. Uh, we've got fire thing right here. It's got a fireplace. You can put you can put a match there. It'll say, like, are you a fucking dragon, mate? Watch. you be a dragon. I'm not a dragon, unfortunately, because I don't play Skyrim, so. Ah, well. What's more popular for PvP, though? Electro or sure no. Oh, oh, what the fuck is that? No, oh, it's loot. What up, boys? We'll go for it, because we can parkour our way out of here. Currently sliding my way over to Electro. Halfway there now. Sliding is one of the fastest ways to move an R3, as you guys will know if you're a veteran. <coughs> I'm just kidding, it's just a fucking stupid bug. Um, but I did actually notice that the zip tie in the bottom right, what happened to my voice in the past five minutes, is actually it's a G button. So if I press uh, Control G or Shift G, one second. Fuck you. Control G? Yeah, Control G, you'll see it'll change to an RG. So I guess the zip tie, I just need to press G on someone, maybe? And I'll just like, instantly zip tie them? That'd be pretty sick. <laughs> I'm not sliding anymore, so. Oh, I just punched my. I'm so sorry. But yeah, well, there's no one in fucking channel, dude. I don't know where everyone is, dude. I'm not running up north, because the thing is, if I run up north, I'll just get sniped by some dude with a fucking SVD. Or something, so. Yeah, I'd rather not waste 20 minutes of that. I'd rather go 20 minutes east and maybe kill someone. Maybe. Got myself a boat. Turns out this killer was not an lecturer. He's got one liter of fuel in it, but we're gonna try to get to Skeleski College. Because, I don't know, people don't spawn in the cities. They spawn either like east of the city or west of the city or in between, maybe, from what I've seen. So, I'm not gonna find anyone in the cities, really. I mean, <laughs> I would if people actually like walk to them, but you know, people are fucking lazy. What's even the point of this thing? It's literally like the same speed as fucking running. I'm just gonna get trapped in the middle of the ocean this way. Whatever, we're gonna like stop between the islands and then shoot fresh spawn and run up to Skaliski. Alright, if I don't find anyone over here, unfortunately we are gonna have to call it a day, because... I don't know, man, I've been walking around for too, too few many fucking years, you know, I'd, I'm considering killing myself, to be perfectly honest. Um, but, I did have a choice to bring a boat over. See a boat right there. 
did still enough fuel in this. Surprisingly, one liter gets you a fucking long way, but I'm gonna opt for the, the walking route, because, not gonna lie, this thing's pretty cool, the bridge. Only problem is, um, unless people know the map already, they won't know this place is here. They need a map to see that it's obviously marked on the map. Uh, so, that, that could be an issue. Maybe no one will be here. But here's, here's hoping for someone. Don't care if it's a freshborn, or if it's a dude that's gonna kill me. Just wanna see someone. It's all about player interaction, whether it's a bullet to the head, or a meaningful love story. Which, I don't think that's ever happened in Daisy, but, you know. You can always hope. I don't know, I feel like this has ended up turning out, uh, like I said before in a few videos, like, I need, like, a kill-death ratio in my video to make it feel like it was a good video. If I don't kill people, it's a bad video. I wanted to come into it and be like, Epic Winter Shinaris PvP. Instead, it's ended up being, like, Lewis running around, and it's snowing. That's pretty much what happened, but it's been okay. It's been okay. This place is cool. This place is cool. Just imagine if I still had a hundred people on it. You know? It'd be more Call of Duty then. But the thing is of Exile, everyone's in a fucking safe zone. Everyone's building bases. Everyone's sucking each other's cocks. So you hardly ever see anyone. Not again. That's why I don't play it. Oh, but I, I do like the idea. I just don't like the idea when you come into it and it's like, there's no one here. It looks pretty cool though. So if place over here, a collage. That's how you pronounce it, obviously. Um, you know, maybe do some sick PvP from, from rooftops. Oh god, I almost fucking fell off. That was spooky. But, there's no zombies. I mean, we haven't seen a single zombie for the entire video, but, yeah. Sometimes you'll see zombies and you know there's someone there then, but there's no zombies here, so I'm assuming there's no one here. It looks pretty cool though, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Hello, is anyone in here getting to education? Oh shit, there's fucking Barack Obama's over here, and a mansion! Oh, the Domek Radnas. This thing's from like Taviana, isn't it? I recognize it, or maybe it's not, I don't know. But yeah, someone's been here before, but is there anyone here right now? Probably fucking not. We're gonna check out the, the mansion, and then we're gonna look at the barracks. Oh, I shouldn't go on top of the roof here. Oh, I don't I don't like this, boys, but you know how I am. I, I am, boys. I'm a risky gamer, you know? I'm not dead. That's something. So we've got a fire up here. Looks like someone's been camping here, you know, while educating each other. I am actually gonna show you guys a tip right here, okay? This is a, this is a pro tip. It might not work, but it might. But you know, there's no one here, so I'm gonna try to show you guys a pro tip. A pro tip is, on any server with armor enhanced movement, if you press space, as soon as you land, you will survive a fall. Okay? I'm gonna drop this just in case. Okay, you guys ready? Watch this, you just need to spam space, watch. Spam space. Pro tip. I'm surprised it even fucking worked. And there's like literally no loot here. Whatever, I'm gonna wrap it up here, guys, okay? I know it wasn't a whale of time, but you know, it was an okay time. I'm gonna run out. If there's no one here, then fucking. That's why the video's ended. But anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. And uh, if you guys like, would like to see some more, maybe we'll head up north. Maybe we'll try out a different server. Uh, just recommend some shit, and maybe I'll try it out. Like, no one recommended me this server. I love when you guys email me and say, check this out, Lewis. I do have some cool shit coming up, thanks to you viewers who have sent me emails saying, check this shit out. But it's also all you bad, bad viewers who don't recommend me shit, and it makes me cry. Makes you cry a lot. But yeah, peace. Park off here, park off here, park off here. Oh. That was just that angle. That was a bad angle.